What's up people, it's your boy Andrew FAQ and today I'm discussing five ways to improve yourself. Let's get to the video. So tip number one, the first tip is to work on your finances. Many people, are chasing, many guys are chasing women and not working on their finances. So my tip number one is to work on your finances, whether it's investments, savings, make sure you're putting money aside, you're chasing your ambition. So when I talk about finances, I mean having multiple streams of income. And that's not has to be a big, uh, big income coming in. It can be something that's a side hustle that you're adding to your collection in case one income fails, you've got another one to back yourself up. For example, when I was um, hustling, I had two jobs. I was working two jobs because I didn't want to um, be in a situation where I didn't have no job in case that one failed. So I had two incomes coming in, helping me um, bridge that gap. So all the bills were paid in one income and the other one I put in the savings and I invested that in stocks. So hopefully you can listen to this. That's tip number one. Tip number two, guys, you need to be focusing on your fitness. There's no two ways about it. Your fitness is a priority. I will say when it comes to like fitness, this is gonna help you mentally, physically, and also it's gonna make you make better decisions. People want, people want to see you the best of yourself. So fitness, going to the gym at least four times a week, follow a program, make sure that your diet is right, make sure that you're eating the right protein, the right nutrition to build big biceps. Cause I'm telling you now, you don't want to be that guy when you're, you've got your girlfriend and they're looking at another guy that's all pumped up. You don't want to be that guy. So you become the best version of yourselves by getting your fitness right. And that's what I'm saying. Follow that program and just get going. Guys, women like a fit guy. Don't make no one tell you different like, oh, I prefer their dad bods. Listen, deep down, they prefer a guy that's in shape. So staying in shape and getting your fitness right is so important to attracting females. I, don't, I can tell you how many times, yeah, when a female's come up to me and said, oh, I like the way you look. You like you go to the gym a lot. And I'm like, yeah, I am. I'm a very active guy. And I know they like it. So I'm telling you, getting your fitness right, it is so important. Four times a week, minimum. Get it right. Let's go. Tip number three. We're going to be talking about fashion. And a lot of guys nowadays don't really know how to dress. I've been watching guys, I'm like, you don't know how to dress. you got to make sure when you're buying your clothes, it is fitted in the right places. Like, for example, when I, if I'm buying my tops, I like my tops to have a taper, so my muscles show. If you want to attract the, the girls, so the girls can look at you and be like, oh, this guy can dress, make sure your clothes is fitted in the right places. Your jeans should be tapered, and your um, t-shirts should be fitted to your body. If you're going gym, you want to um, show that you're going gym, show the muscles, so the muscles are, are pumping out, so that will attract the opposite sex. You want to be more appealing, showing the, um, and the girls that you know how to dress. That's tip number three. Fashion sense is important. So when you're buying your, your suits, make sure that it is tailored fit to your body. You want that suit to enhance your muscles, enhance your physique. Because that's one thing that's going to show you out to the crowd is your physique. Make sure that your suit is tapered to the T. Everything is showing, you feel confident, and once you have a nice um, a suit tapered to your body, you're going to feel more proud. Tip number four, and this one is not mentioned a lot, and that is having the right skincare routine. I'll tell you how many times, yeah, that I have to sort of make sure that my skin is glowing. I wash my, my skin twice a day at least. I use a face scrub um, for the morning and the evening. I use, a, I use a wash to, to cleanse my skin before I go to bed. And also using the eye drops as well to remove any dark circles. Skincare is so important. It's how you present yourself to the world. When people see your skin is glowing, they will take you more serious. So having a good skincare program is going to help you stand out in the dating market, in your, in your daily life, and overall gives you confidence in the world. Get the right skincare program. Tip number five. Tip number five, guys. And this leads to the ultimate tip, having confidence. Listen, if you don't have confidence, everything else is voidable. You've got to have confidence. If you have confidence in how you look and how you feel, you will stand out. Women like a confident man. I am telling you now, the amount of times where I've seen a woman and the guy is moving shy, because he's moving shy, she ain't even giving him attention. If a guy now shows her confidence, because remember, you are the prize. You are the prize, guys. 
Don't make nobody tell you different. You are the prize. If you go up to a woman and be like, hey, I like how you look. What's your name? And you come up across as a confident man, guess what? She's gonna be like, wow, this guy's actually approached me. I don't usually get approached like this because guys are always shy nowadays. So having confidence is key to pulling women. You will get the right woman with confidence. So get your confidence right. And obviously, the four tips I mentioned before about your finances, your fashion, skincare, all that leads to confidence. Once you get all those things um, patterned, you will glow. You will, st you will stand out in the market. You will step out in the world and be like, I am the shit. I run this shit. You guys can do it. That's it, guys. I hope you love this video. If you do, click on the um, subscribe button if you're new to this channel. FAQ Fitness, Andrew, you know we do. Next video, we're going to be talking more about this. Let's go.